Hey everybody. Whew. Well, it is Sunday and tomorrow is Christmas Eve and I have a lot of stuff to go through and show you guys. First off, I've got some happy mails. I wanted, I was kind of waiting to go through so I just unsealed things so it would be easier. Um, but this is from my friend, um, Kim. Look at this cute card. Isn't this just beautiful? It is so pretty. So pretty. Let me make sure I'm in the middle. I am. And these cute little owls. <laughs> it's just such a cute card. Kim, thank you so much. So pretty. And I love this tissue paper. So let's see what this Happy Meal package is. Oh, look at it. Oh, nice. Oh, oh it is like the cutest owl tote ever. Look at this owl tote. Isn't it just adorable? Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. Oh, you made it. Oh my goodness. Kim. Thank you. Oh, see, right in there it says handmade. Oh, thank you, thank you. This is so cute. I just love it. Thank you for thinking of me and making something so adorable. And, oops, there was something else there. I think I just, I did, oh, I dropped it. <laughs> I knew there was something else there. And you made me one of your ornaments. I saw these on um, Kim's Instagram page. And they are so cute. Isn't that just the cutest ornament? I'm going to put that on my tree. So adorable. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Thank you so much really blessed. Okay, and then the other happy mail. I'm just going to go ahead and do this. I want to use a little bit of this in my journal. This happy mail is from my friend Rosie. And I forgot to clean off my countertop, so now everything is truly a mess. <laughs> it's just, it's the craziness of Christmas, I'm afraid. That I have everything everywhere. Oh my goodness. My room's going to need a good cleaning. So isn't this cute? These had to be Tim Holtz stamps. I didn't know he had Christmas ones. Oh, and I slit this because I didn't want to mess up this adorable. This is a December, a Christmas um, wax seal and I didn't want to mess it up so I slit this open. I slit everything open ahead of time but I haven't looked at it so I'm super excited. So this is from Rosie and thank you for this amazing happy mail. Okay so here's a card. It's very pretty. Ah, so sweet. Uh, little things to do list. These are cute. Oh, Midori. Interesting. I've never seen this. It is really cute. Okay, so let's put the card here. I have to figure out. I don't even know if I'm going to do this in my journal yet. And it's already, it is almost four o'clock on Sunday. So this day has kind of gotten away from me. Oh, this is so cool. It's like a bag. It's a bag made out of paper that's like writing paper. So, very cool. No, I don't want to have to tear anything. Ooh. So, we have... Oh, look at this. It's a postcard. Beautiful vintage postcard. And look at this cute postcard. Oh, it's so cute. I love it. And these 
Look at these. Oh man, I absolutely adore these. They are just stunning. Wow. Wow, so cool. Thank you. So what else? Look at this. I love this. Look at this cute bag. This bag is fantastic. And she has things in it as well. I don't know where you get these cool things, but they are so neat. <laughs> Hello Kitty. I think these are sticky notes. Yep. And oh, look at these cute little vellum pieces. Wow. This is so cool. Thank you so much. Just gonna slip that back in there for now while I figure everything out. Um, let's do this next. Ooh, look at all this. This looks like a coffee cup, like a latte clip. And let's just look in here. This is really cute. Oh, um, we have, look at that. That is so much fun. Graphique. What a cute, cute card. And then over here, ah, uh, look at the cute owls. Oh my gosh. So cute. And then look at this. Oh, this is so cool. You know what? Aiko Fukawa. I think I need to, let me just check something really quick. This reminds me of a style of a book um, that I got at a library sale. It's not the same person, I don't think. It's a book, and look at it. It is so much that same style. So who's the illustrator? The writer, Kaya, Kaya Doi, is the writer, but I wish I knew who illustrated this book because it's pretty amazing. And I don't know if he wrote it and illustrated it, or I don't know. But it's so similar. It's so, the style is um, very much the same. It's really cool. And, oh, cute. <laughs> Telegram paper. This is really nice. Just these little papers are so nice. I love them. I really do. Look here. Little notes. <laughs> Very cute. And then we have like that. Oh, these are adorable. Oh my gosh. So darn cute. <laughs> so cute. I love this sort of stuff. I really do. Um, I just think it's, it's so pretty. Look at that. And then these. Oh my gosh. I really, really love this type of style a lot. Oh, and then this was in here. And these are envelopes. And... Oh, look at this beautiful, beautiful paper. And it feels so cool. I wish you could I wish you could see what it feels like. Rosie, you are just spoiling me. Oh man. It's almost like a homemade paper. The feel of it. It's just it feels kind of like the homemade paper I got from India. So beautiful. Thank you for thinking of me. What a lovely, lovely gift. And there's more. I'm just like overwhelmed. It's just amazing. So I didn't open this all the way because I wanted to be surprised. 
So we have, I have to keep some paper for the journal. Um, oh my gosh. This is so, you know what? I was going to buy myself another fountain pen and I decided to wait. And I'm glad I waited. I've never heard of this one. Kakunu. And the color. I mean that green. That is like a favorite, favorite color of mine. And I wonder, can I open this? Or does it, is it some kind of special way to open it? Is it a mystery? <laughs> I don't know. It looks like... I, I see. I see how it works. I want to open it. I want to see what it looks like. Okay. I mean, this is just really special. I just feel totally spoiled by my friends who have been just blessing me with things. So this is the type of... I think this is the type I use of the ink. Look at that. It's so cool. And then the pen itself. So let's see if I have to put put the ink in here or if they have ink in it already or do I need to open it? Okay, so it's all ready for the ink to go in. So I think I'll just go ahead and open this little package because I don't I really want to use this stuff in my journal there's some really cute pieces that I can put in the journal so including this I think this is the ink cartridges I use too it looks like it's correct so we go like that and then it takes a little for it to come through, so I'm not going to do that on camera, but oh my gosh, it's so cute. I love it. Thank you. Thank you so much. What a beautiful, lovely, lovely gift. And this, I have no idea what this is. I'm super excited about it. Oh, it looks like something really nice and special. Oh my gosh. Where's the English part? Gift and creative papers. I have to open this. I I have no idea what this is. Like what these are like because I've never had anything like this. So let's see. I think I can just kind of get the plastic started so I can get it off. There we go. Oh, I'm pretty excited about this too. Man, I really feel spoiled and blessed because I wasn't expecting anything. And then you just spoiled me like crazy. Okay. Wow. Wow. I mean, this is amazing. And the pages are perforated, so you can take them out. And, oh, wow. And it's not just, like, I'm going to go ahead and, I think, take out one set of the papers. Because I have never seen anything like this. Not only does it open that way, I mean, you can't even see the whole thing. It's a whole big sheet of paper. So this is only a fourth of it. And look at it. It's all the same picture, but it's just, it's totally amazing. And it's just full. I mean, I don't even know where you found anything like this, Rosie. I've never seen anything like this in my entire life. It is stunning. Thank you so, so much. Wow. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I don't even know what to say. It's so beautiful. Thank you. I want to show some other things. I thought you might like to see this, and I just wanted to show it. I'm going to use some of it in my Christmas journal. But I got this paper at Aldi's for Christmas, and I wrapped Christmas presents in this paper. Isn't it adorable? Oh my goodness, I have to use it. 
in my journal as well. Plus, they had stickers that matched. So I have to like, I have to use that. <laughs> also, I did buy some fountain pens that I'm only using for my health and wellness planner. So uh, yeah, I did buy those, but um, I'll show them to you. And this, I kept this part just because I wanted to use it, but these are the inks. These were the inks. And these are Varsity Everyday Fountain Pen, and it's a really thick fountain pen. It's not, and it comes in these colors. So black, dark blue, light blue, kind of a, a green as you can see, purple, red and pink and they definitely write thicker uh, i'm using them in a recollections uh, undated planner that my friend galena gave me that's my going to be like my health and wellness food planning exercise tracking type thing um that's what that's specifically for and um since i wanted to see if i could maybe Peel the sticker off of here. So I'm going to try because if it will come off without me ruining it, I can um, stick it in my notebook. But I don't know. I'm gonna just see what I can do. Nope really wanted that part so I suppose my other option is just to cut the plastic cut plastic with my scissors that get used and abused all the time but yeah seven pans and that's only for that particular planner um, I finding more and more that I just want to gravitate toward um, fountain pens, to use fountain pens for things. So that's kind of the reason behind that. And so I'm super excited because I was planning to get a fountain pen um, that I wanted to use for uh, journaling, a specific journal. So I'm super happy, like that's perfect. I also went yesterday to uh, Arc Value Village, which is a thrift store. And I was um, helping my granddaughter pick out stocking gifts. <laughs> and look what I found. I paid a dollar for this. Um, this is from Target.com, I guess, but it's um, a flashcard set. And I thought it would be, it's so cool. Look at this. Isn't this great? It's so great. I wanna use this in my journals that I sell. I love it. I mean, it's flashcards that are periodic table of elements. That's the kind of flashcards it is. And it's so, it's so cool. So I'm gonna save this bit of packaging so that I can put that in my journal as well. There's always like a million things you can use in your journals. I've certainly managed to find them. But isn't that cool? That's just gonna be so perfect for some elements in my journaling. And then I found these cards, so I paid 79 cents a pack. And um, they are so darn cute, you guys. Look, aren't these so cute? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, they, they're adorable. So that's the animal rummy on that one. And then on this one, and I think I'll just take one out of each and put it in my journal too. The other one is this hearts. So look at this. I'll take this one out because it's a little damaged anyway. But I love these type of things for journals. They're just really fun to use in the journal, journal making, you know, for uh, I like to make journaling cards out of this sort of thing. So, yeah. 
another nice little find. So I'll use those. And I really want to start, I need to get my, I don't even know where to start, honest, honestly. I don't know where to start. Oh, I want to show you what else I found. And I picked up because I, I couldn't stand it. Um, I went to the store um, and I bought a card, a Christmas card for my husband. And I saw this card. Isn't it, it's a brand new card, of course, but isn't it adorable with its um, vintagey feel? You are dear to me. I'm putting that in my Christmas, my Santa journal because I like this way too much. I have to keep it. <laughs> it's so cute. It's so cute. Okay, so, oof, I feel like I am, it just feels crazy because I'm at the point where I need to put some stuff away because it's getting crazy in here. Okay, so let's see what kind of time I got to do Friday. I cannot believe how close we're getting to the end of the month. Um, so let's just see what I can manage to get done. And I think I'm gonna go ahead and put the owl stamp on here now before I put it in the book when it's a little bit harder. And um, yeah, that's much better time to do that. And I got it, you know, we were busy today. Yesterday was Saturday and I had no time to get in here with everything that was going on and then getting Sadie. Um, we were just really busy and the time just, the time really got away fast. It didn't, it didn't take long. And then today being Sunday, we, um, of course went to church and then we had to do, I had to find something to use as a clue for my daughter's present that's not going to arrive until after Christmas. So I needed a clue and we looked, I looked all over in all kinds of stores and I thought, you know what? Barnes and Noble, they're going to have what I want. I needed something with Sailor Moon on it to use as a clue for her. And I ended up getting a manga book because, and I'm just going to put the gift receipt in it so she can return it if she doesn't want it. But it's a Sailor Moon and it's short stories. So if she doesn't want it, she can return it and if she, or if she has it, but if she doesn't, and she can totally keep keep this, but it's going to be the clue because of what she's got coming. So I do need to get this receipt off of here. This price tag has to get off. I don't know. I hate price tags on things like this because they don't. They put them on here so they stay like permanently. You just can't get them off. But anyway, that's the type of thing she likes. And I got her something, a Sailor Moon item, uh, which is not arriving in time. I told my husband not to text me that I would be taping. And he texts me, is this what you really want for Rachel? Now I have to look, guys. Okay, I'm sorry. I'll be back. Okay, yes, my husband found exactly what I wanted for my daughter, a Sailor Moon figurine. <laughs> oh my gosh, so now I can return that book because that's so much better. Because all I wanted was a little clue for her not to have to buy a whole book. So Friday, uh, it stayed in the 20s all day and it was cloudy all day. We did have some light, light snow showers in the morning. Um, Michael's is open at 7 a.m. to 11 p.m. So I stopped at Michael's, like I said, and I got those uh, fountain pen, that Varsity fountain pen um, that I'm using for a specific planner. So what I think I'll do is just, I'm just going to clip that, staple that on there instead. It'll just be easier. All right, and then I can glue this here to the book. So what else? Um, well, I had a hot chocolate packet and because we had hot chocolate at night. And we went to Wendy's for supper because after work, I got off work. Um, right before I got off work, 
from the owners of the company they gave a uh, gift card look at this glitter I mean glitter e <laughs> but it's a gift card from it was a gift card from them for fifty dollars so I spent part of it and got a, a kind of a faux leather purse slash tote to carry to work for my traveler's notebooks and such that I want to bring to work, planners, etc. Um, and the rest I'll use toward my husband and I going out to eat because he got a gift card to uh, Round Robin, Red Robins, and so we figured between the two we get a good meal, like to do it that way. Um, also, he brought me a Starbucks, and it was the last. It had to be like the last pumpkin latte that they even had. And then, like I said, we had hot chocolate later, and my husband and I decided to go sh do our shopping right away because we had to get groceries at all these, a couple last-minute things at Walmart. So we stopped and ate at Wendy's, and then we rented the movie Unbroken, Path to Redemption, and watched that, watched an episode of The Great American Baking Show Holiday Edition, and read Before Bed, which means it was midnight when I got to bed. But it was a Friday night, so that's okay. So I'm gonna put this crazy, overly, overly done <laughs> glittery mess right here. Whew, it's crazy. And then I've already done like the card. I don't have to worry about the gift card. Um, so I'm just going to like put this in here because that's where it was, but it wasn't like fastened it was kind of big but I'm just gonna put it here this is gonna be so bulky you guys so bulky but let's see did that work oh my gosh it actually worked here all I'm doing is ugh, trying to staple that one did not work in this card. It's the angle. There we go. Whew. I think that's just a little easier to staple it in there like that. Okay, so there's the um, gift card and that craziness. And then maybe I could just put like that Starbucks, or I could put this varsity thing um, here. Maybe the Starbucks. Just trying to figure out what I want to do. But yeah, we've got all the Christmas stuff done. Did all the Christmas, the gift wrapping um, is done. So, you know, we did get some things accomplished. I'm thinking that this would make a good, like, little pocket. I could just put it right here, and I could just slip some of this stuff in here. <sighs> I'm just thinking about that. Just, is that what I want to do? How many days? I've, I have enough days, because if I just went, like, let's count it like this. 31, 30... 29, 28, 27, 26, Christmas Day, 25, 25, Christmas Day is longer, Christmas Eve, today, Saturday, yeah, I can, yeah, I can use part of another page and just go ahead and finish off the little bit of this ephemera and then start on Saturday, which I think I might have to just start putting some of that down. And actually, the Happy Mail gifts came on Thursday and Friday and Saturday. I got one each day, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. That was really nice. Very nice. Anyway, I think I'll just... Uh, Put some things down like this and maybe we'll just cut this package I just certainly don't need the whole package do I 
I just need the part that applies. Ooh, you can smell the chocolate. <laughs> this was caramel cream, and I got this from a friend. So let's just put that over here. And then we'll take this last little thing with the pens, and we'll put that here. Yeah, I think that's fine. We'll do it like this, and then it shows the pens. Okay, then um, I'll come back to this. So I did the gift I got from, yeah, this was the one. That was from Mandy. And I was thinking, when did I get... I just, I can't remember when I got things because it's been crazy. Can't help it. <laughs> anyway, for Saturday, Sunday, I'm just going to start putting some of this stuff down. Because yesterday, let's see, this is from my friend. But let's put down some of these other things before I put the gifts in the cards and just kind of put down all kinds of, I mean, I just got so many things. So I'm just gonna start laying down some of the wrapping things I've got and bits and pieces and just make a whole little layer of everything because I'm not sure how else to do this. So we're just gonna have fun. And look at this, isn't this cute? I think if I just do it so it comes comes off the edge, maybe, or, hmm. It's really cute, but unfortunately, these are for some socks, off of socks that I wrapped presents for. And I'm just putting down these things that are things I got on Friday night, on Saturday, um, like, I don't even know every day that I got stuff. Like, I got something for Sadie, and when I wrapped the presents, this was, like, one of the things, the tag from my granddaughter's birthday present. Um, and that's not the only one. There's other tags. I'm going to come back to that page, and I'm just going to keep doing some of this stuff so I'm gonna have that come up just a little bit and then here's something else we got for one of her stocking gifts those is this whoop, <laughs> minecraft thing so we'll put that there and then um, I got that stuff from Goodwill so I have that flashcard set and I'm going to lay that here. And then I'm going to put these cards. And just look at the backs. Aren't those fantastic? It's almost like, which do I like more? You know? And it looks like I can actually do this as, yeah, as a tuck in for these cards. Because, you know what, I just love the back. Hmm, she says. What does she do? <laughs> she decides to make... I decide to make a flip instead. I don't know what to do otherwise. Um, hoping that this... Um, does not like my phone doesn't decide it's had enough recording and uh, shut off on me and I don't know that it's shut off on me because believe me I know that can happen okay so what I'm doing I'll show you what I'm doing I'm just doing it as a flip because I like the idea of being able to see the cards, and I'm not even going to put this on the back side, but I just think it's nice that way. I also got a couple of stamps off of envelopes, and this 
is a repeat stamp, so I'm just gonna put it here. And I don't think I have, do I have, let me look. I said that was a repeat stamp, it is. I have this one is a repeat, but I have the chickadee and that is not a repeat. So that one can go here, because we got a bunch of Christmas cards yesterday. But people send out less and less Christmas cards, so, I mean, we do too. I do, like, less and less every year, so I'm not surprised, you know, that everybody is doing less and less. That's normal. But I thought, you know, I'm just going to put them here because I think... That will be a nice way to do this. Okay. It's kind of a hodgepodge, and I'm going to go back later and decorate, but just because there's so much, um, you just have to have the room. So now I want to put uh, the Happy Mail cards. So <clears throat> I want a piece of this paper. So I'm just going to do this like this I just love this so pretty so pretty I've been hanging on to this sort of stuff too for to use because I just like it okay so we'll come back here do some more things on here um, I want to use some of this tissue paper to put the card on um, so I'm just going to oops throw a bunch of glue on here and then I'm just going to layer the tissue paper down on here and even though it's like that it doesn't matter it's okay all right and then here is this beautiful 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 card so I'm gonna put that there I know pretty soon oh my goodness I can't I have to put the envelope because I have to be able to slip it in the envelope so I'm going to <laughs> what do I do I'm gonna do this <clears throat> I don't know what to do and I'm going to Ugh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna make a mess. I'm going to take that off. And I'm gonna slip this in here. Let's see if I can do this. There. Oh my gosh. And I'm just gonna write here Happy Mail. from Kim. Okay. I'll come back and do some decorating. I'm gonna run out of pages. <laughs> and then I wanna do the one from... Hey everyone. Well, I have some more time. I can get done some more. Um, this whole video is gonna be long. <laughs> Not only long, but I ended up like doing three parts. So it's just gonna be long. But uh, cause I had this, it ran, a, ran out partway through, and I kept talking, not realizing that it had stopped. So I took time, and I let my phone charge up, and did some other stuff, and so now I'm back. Um, to, I want to finish the decorating. This is where I left off. I did this. And then I started talking about the next page and then it cut off. So here's what, which means I didn't show you. Oh yeah, I showed you the pen in the Happy Mail. Um, and I tried the pen right here and it writes like butter, just beautiful. So anyway, I put the wrapping paper from Rosie down. I put all of this um, from the pen on here and her card and the envelope. So now what I want to do is just put Saturday and Sunday um, on that page. 
I'm going to put the owls down and then um, I'm going to just decorate with washi, maybe some stickers, and then it will be done. But um, so today, today uh, we got up and we had Sadie, of course, and took her to church. Well, Doug made us pancakes for breakfast. That's usually what we have with Sadie because she likes her pancakes. Um, so we did that. Went to church. And then we took Sadie home after church. And um, visited a little bit with my daughter and her husband. And then we took off um, to try and find that Sailor Moon thing. Which my husband found something better. So I'm returning that book to Barnes and Noble. Anyway, I need to get my owl sticker on here. So I'm going to I'm going to put them here for Sunday and then I got to put Saturdays down on the corner right there. I think that'll be fine. Okay. Um and then he went out geocaching and I've been recording. <laughs> And soon it'll be time to do supper. So, but yeah, I went ahead and did this. Um, ended up, I didn't know it wasn't recording. So, that just happens sometimes. I don't think I really talked about much. So, there's Saturday. There's Sunday. This will be Christmas Eve. Christmas Day, maybe 4. 26, 27, 28, 29. Yeah. I have to do Christmas Day, maybe try and just do one. I should be able to just do one. But yeah, I put down this wrapping paper here. That was something else I did on camera as I put this wrapping paper down that I bought. That was so cute and I wanted to use it. I got it at Aldi's and then the stickers came with it and the stickers like here has the sloth but with... <laughs> with the sweater on so yeah and tonight we're just gonna we're gonna make some Indian food some tikka masala and rice and we have some mini naan bread and um, we'll watch something on TV and just kind of relax that's that's the plan so really all I have to do is go back and decorate all the pages it's kind of a disaster right now so I'm gonna at least try and do some stickers and oops, some washi tape and just finish up so that uh, <laughs> so it's done because it's a ton of pages it's just a ton of pages so we have this and um, <clears throat> I just want to see what I got that would be fun to just decorate the pages. And I I got this whole thing of like nutcrackers and I'm thinking it would be kind of fun to decorate this page with a whole bunch of these nutcrackers. Because this is actually kind of entertaining, I think. And so I'm thinking, hey, this will be kind of cool. And then I can't get all the way over, so I'll do this tree right there. And we'll do this little sprig of holly right there. And I got a little ornament. And I got a little star I'm going to put on the belly of my owl, I think. There. There. Isn't that cute? Oh my gosh, so cute. And I've got this one last, I guess it's a tin soldier. It looks like nutcrackers to me too though. I think I'll put this one right, right here. Let's see, it's on the page. There, I like that. I, I think that's cute. That was actually kind of a fun way to, to do some decorating, right? And I have some coffee with me too. Trying to, <clears throat> I made a cup of coffee and I thought, man, I didn't finish drinking it before I was ready to 
to do this again because since my husband's still out doing stuff, I don't think he's shopping now. I think he's geocaching now. So he's doing fun stuff too. Um, but I asked him, like, do I have time? Are you going to be back soon? Or do I have time to, like, do some more recording and get this done? Because I have a lot I want to finish. And he's like, no, you got time. Go for it. So, <laughs> thank goodness, because I have plenty I, want, I need to get done. I want to get this decorating done. Actually, let's... Let's just bring this over part way. Why not, right? Kind of make it pretty. This one I got, I can put some stickers down since I have plenty of space. Oops. But I just want to do a few decorative bits and pieces of things things because why not so okay and what else should we do how about I do want to start getting this you know I have so much of this thin washi and I want to go ahead and you know use it. It's, it's cute stuff. So I'm just going to do some just do some stuff with it. Decorating. Okay, so there's some. And let's do let's run this color across here. Okay. And then we can go like that. And we can actually just cross it and go, oops. <laughs> that didn't work, did it? Go all the way up. All right. And let's see, I have some more. So let's do, let's see what else we can do. There we go. This is the one that says no peeking. Okay, and how about we put some here and I'll just trim that little piece off. And then I gotta find some stickers that will look good there. All right, and let's just let's just bring it up here, okay? And it's kind of fun, I think. I like to use the washi to decorate. I think it's kind of fun to just um, do interesting things with it and make it fun. You can do like this. Okay. All right, and then that's leaving me a space right there, so that's what I wanted to do. Bring this one right here. Okay, so um, that means I'll put put something here. So let me see. Do I have some stuff I can use? I'm trying to use some things up that I have, and uh, even if they're just, you know. Silly. They're weird. They don't match anything. It doesn't really matter. <laughs> I'm just kind of, this is just going to be a collage of Christmassy related items that are kind of fun to just stick around on the page because why not? 
oops, like that. Let's put this gate over here and we'll put the 25th over here. And it's just a hodgepodge. It is, it's just a hodgepodge, not there. Let's put it here. <clears throat> okay, then we're gonna go over here and these, of course, were gifts for Sadie. So I think the no peeking tape is probably perfect for this area. No peeking <laughs> for the gifts. All right. And I don't know. I wonder, 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 wonder what I could put. <clears throat> I have some more cute things. I'd just like to kind of use these, some of this stuff up. So I'm going to just do some more stickers. I have some cute stickers from last year, and it's kind of fun to just kind of use them up here and there. Like super adorable. I mean, look at this. This is so, so cute. Here's the trees again. And my coffee's getting cold because I haven't used it yet. There. That's cute. And is there anything else I can put here? Well, how about this cute little elf? He's adorable. And then I have this cute snowman that I might as well put over on this page. Oh, and a mitten. Let's put the mitten here. So we're just kind of decorating it up and doing a few things. I could have sworn that's where this tape ended. Hmm. There it is. There it is. I'm thinking I need to uh, just get some tape down here a little bit. I don't need a lot. Okay. All right, pretty simple, right? And maybe we'll come up here just because it's it could use that little bit of extra stick, I think, to it. And I think I'm going to put this merry and bright right here. Okay, I like that. All right, so then we go to, and then of course these flips, so you could see the back side of those cards. Um, and we went here and um, we ended up, ended up putting the card here, so I don't have anything on this page, but I'm just gonna leave it. I, I just, I like it. So I don't feel like I need anything. Maybe I'll just put a little bit of this pretty washy that says Merry and Bright because it seems to go well. And then if I get something and I feel like it will um, fit, then I'll stick it in there. Otherwise, I'm just going to leave it because it's pretty. And here I'm just going to use my... Let's see, which tape do I want here? I'm thinking this one would be really pretty just as an accent tape. Yeah, so really I'm just decorating right now because I've already got um, everything in here for the past three days. And I'm just gonna go pretty quick on the decorating because I don't want, I, the video is going to be long, but I don't want it to be like insane and you guys are like wondering why on earth I 
thought I needed to do an hour or more long video. <laughs> I'm trying, I'm trying not to go too crazy, I, seriously. But anyway, I thought I'd just put a couple little things to round this out and kind of finish it up. That and there. And then, oops, maybe up here just to kind of give it a, the end. Okay, I think that's good. I don't want to overdo, and I just want it to look nice. I could do, I got this deeper washi. right over here deeper colored which actually would look really nice along this edge okay so let's bring we're just gonna bring that one all the way up okay I don't think I have anything on that other page good because I'm feeling like I've got a lot all right, and then we'll do this one, and then let's just go, just going to make a patchwork quilt of this type of thing. I like it. I think it looks, these skinny washies are seriously the most fun. I really like them a lot. Okay, and that just kind of completes it, and it looks good. All right, and I'm thinking a little bit here, just because. Okay, I think that's good. I like this, and really the only thing I had left was a little bit right here. So, I'm going to go ahead with this washi here, and I'm going to do a little, oops, a little bit right here. I'm going to cut this piece off. Okay. And then I'll just do a piece of decoration there. Alright, there. Okay. I think we're done with the washi. And I want to put um, this. The brown see if I can get these old old oh my gosh these are so old they are coming apart if I can just make them stay together just enough to get them off come on you can do it oh my gosh it's very gentle isn't this pretty there we go. See? I like that. These are so old that they were starting to tear. These are old, old creative memories. Again, I, I like creative memories. And actually, that is turning out quite cute. We'll do one there. I I like it. Now let's try and get this other one off. I didn't realize how old these are getting. You have to be so careful with some of this stuff. So let's put this one like this. There. Okay, so now I'm done, guys. I'm done. Let's look. Let's see what we did today. So we have Friday, Friday, Saturday, 
Saturday, Saturday, Saturday. I think this was Friday. Um, Saturday, Sunday. So yeah, and look at how how big it is. It is just, it's so fat. It really is. But I have enjoyed this one so much. And even though I put this in here, I'm actually going to take this out and put it in my Santa book because I really want to keep this and use it for Chris, my forever, you know. So there we go. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, thanks for sticking through the whole video if you made it through my very, very long video. And I hope you guys have a wonderful Christmas Tomorrow's Christmas Eve, and then it's Christmas Day, and I hope it is marvelous and wonderful and joyful for you. Bye.